Thank you. Olivia Mott had no comment Tuesday morning after learning she won't go to jail and instead be placed on probation in connection with her second DWI arrest. Although it was her first DWI conviction, it was the second of three times that she's been arrested for drunk driving. The first charge was dismissed with a diversion program. Tuesday's guilty plea came as a plea deal made possible with the cooperation of a victim's family in a third DWI arrest on the causeway that claimed the life of a Mississippi man. The victim's family doing so to get to the third DWI arrest in vehicular homicide case. So now they can stop playing this court against the other court and come on with the big fish. Quinetta Blackman is the widow of James Blackman, who was killed in the March 2017 causeway accident in which Matt was allegedly driving drunk and subsequently arrested for the third time. Blackman believes Tuesday's suspended six-month sentence is preferential treatment, but agreed to the plea deal to move the justice process along. This is not the end of the case. This is the stumbling stone that was in the way of the bigger case. So now justice can go ahead and prevail. Matt's attorney did not want to comment on this morning's guilty plea and said they will be back in court on May 14th for pretrial for Matt's third DWI arrest and vehicular homicide charge. This morning, the judge ordered Olivia Mott to remain under house arrest until she goes to trial for that case in Jefferson Parish. In St. Tammany, Michael Vincent, WDSU News.